Hey, this is Bryce from BryceCooley.com showing you how to do the stuff that I like to do. Today I'm going to do a quick how-to for the Jailbreak app Bar Magnet. Bar Magnet is a very simple app that allows you to remotely control your torrent client and add torrents from your favorite torrent sites wherever you are. To get Bar Magnet, open Cydia and search Bar Magnet one word. If you search B-A-R-M, it should come up. Select it and you'll click install. Now I've already installed it, so I'm going to bypass this part and go straight to the app. When you first open Bar Magnet, you should see this, a blank screen with a red strip that says Host Offline. You're going to go down to the bottom right corner in the gear icon. And here's where you put in your torrent client info. I use uTorrent. There are several options, Transmission, BitTorrent, Deluge, etc. And it asks you for several things. Hostname, port, username, password, query, and torrent site. For my purposes, wanting to add torrents remotely when I'm not at home, hostname is the IP address of my home computer. The port, username, and password are all set on your uTorrent client, which I will get to shortly. The query down below is a query specific to whatever torrent site you want to use. So let me cut over really quick to the setup on the computer. I use uTorrent on Mac OS X. Some of the steps may be different depending on what torrent client you use and what OS you have. But if you use uTorrent, Go into it and go to Preferences. You're going to jump over to Remote. You're going to click the Web UI tab if it is not already there. Click Enable Local Web UI Server and then create a username and password. Make note of your listening port. At this point, as far as your computer is concerned, you're good to go. On the host name spot in the app, you need to put your computer's IP. To do this, go to whatismyip.com. Whatever IP shows up at the top, that's what IP you're going to put in the host name section. Under port, you're going to put the same port that it shows in your uTorrent client under listening port. And again, you'll put the username and password that you created in uTorrent. This query section's a little different. You're going to go to your torrent site of choice and figure out what their query link is. I will use the Pirate Bay for this example. Now what I did, I just searched Pirate Bay Query String. And I noticed it's right here. You can go to the site. And this is what you want. This is the base string for whatever query you want to be done through this app. So that's what you're going to type in. But there's one thing at the end you want to make sure you get. After that equal sign, instead of any specific word, you're going to use the percentage sign, the word query, and a closing percentage sign. You can put the URL of the torrent site that you prefer here. Going to click done. And then you click back. If you experience this issue where you've done everything right and you're still seeing host offline, it's likely that you need to make a firewall exception or set port forwarding on your router. If all goes well, you should see the red bar turn blue and say host online. At this point, if you've done everything right, you're going to click the plus sign in the top right and search for whatever you want. I'm going to click search. You notice Pirate Bay showed up. 
with the search string already there for War of the Worlds. You can then download specifically the magnet link. Click on that. A little green bar says Torrent successfully added. So if we look over to uTorrent, we should see War of the Worlds. And there it is. So that's how you use Bar Magnet, set it up using at least the iPhone 5S, jailbroken, and a MacBook Pro running uTorrent. I hope that's helpful. And have a wonderful day.